Hi, I'm Judith Polgar, the world's best female chess player. I'd like to introduce you my educational program that helps children in skill development and creative thinking. Let's go and visit the school. While Judith Polgar and her sister Sofia are on their way to their destination, pupils in public elementary school in Budapest are preparing for their skill building lesson in chess. This primary school is no different from any other regular school apart from one thing. In September 2012, the Judith Polgar Chess Foundation started an experimental project called Chess Palace jointly with the school. Now we are heading to an elementary school in Budapest where the kids and the teachers using this educational tool on a daily basis and uh, they are very happy. So I can't wait to get there and see them. Judith Polgar and her team have developed a new, so far unique method. Instead of teaching chess as a sport and game the traditional way, their method goes beyond normal chess lessons. Chess becomes an exceptional learning tool. This is especially useful for children born into our current digital society who gain most of their information through the internet rather than learning to develop their own thinking. Starting in 2013, Judith Polgar's scale building chess program is officially part of Hungary's national curriculum. The program is not about training chess players. Although it is based on basic rules of chess, the whole subject is integrated into the regular curriculum and helps children make better progress in their main subjects, such as maths and science, and even reading, writing and arts and crafts. The European Parliament adopted the written declaration Chess in School in 2012. As a member of ECU's committee, Judith Polgar created an educational curriculum framework for Hungary. But as always, it is not the paperwork that counts. The real strength of the program is reflected in the great enthusiasm and enjoyment of the children participating in the project. Through chess, children develop their understanding of spatial relationships, which is like a built-in human GPS an essential skill for starting the learning progress in school. The sense of spatial relationships, as well as pattern recognition, is extremely important in learning to read, write and do basic maths. In chess, the children actually carry out the spatial concepts physically on the chessboard. Polgar's program, called Chess Palace, helps children reach their potential by teaching chess using a wide range of tools, Rhymes, songs, chess cards, chess money, chess dice and much more. Chess Palace program also provides a detailed learning toolkit available even to schools with very limited finances so they can adopt the whole program easily. The students themselves use their favorite colors to decorate the plastic chessboard provided in each kit. Finally, Judith arrives at the school and right away starts a little presentation to children. Although the Polgar sisters became famous as the subject of educational experiment in their childhood, Judith's chess program is based on her experiences as a parent. In this program, playing chess, while well, is not the goal, it is a tool, an extremely efficient tool for creative and logical thinking, quick, smart decision making, it is a learning playground in which the chessboard represents a very real, physical boundary, while still offering an endless number of creative solutions during the game. The basic concept of this playful way of learning is very presented in the rhyming verses of the student's book. Chess 
Chess Palace brings the chess pieces to life. Characters based on historic figures and friendly graphics designed by Sofia Polgar make the program appealing to children. No wonder, none of the students want to leave this world of make-believe. Chespolis is an elementary textbook and workbook series for students in grades 1 to 4. The structure of the book is very consistent. Each lesson begins with a picture association gallery to help students find the links among their everyday life, the world of stories and the chessboard. To check their progress, the end of every chapter presents riddles and a true or false quiz. Also, the students can circle faces that best express their emotions related to that lesson. The workbook provides exceptionally strong skill training linked with maths, reading, writing, science, arts and foreign languages. Students learn while having fun without leaving their beloved chess palace world. The exercises are completely integrated into the regular elementary school curriculum, matching the pupils' level of knowledge gained in their other classes. The Judith Polga Chess Foundation has organized a 30-hour, solution-oriented accredited training program for teachers to help them introduce the program at their schools. This training provides them new teaching ideas, practical tips and advice on the best practices. Chess, with its 1,500-year history and popularity, long ago proved its enduring value. However, in our digital world, the game of chess gains special relevance. With its system of different symbols and a constant switching between two dimensions and three dimensions, chess helps students to develop a holistic, visual way of thinking and to organize a structure to huge amount of information they are exposed to day after day. One of the most important benefits of the program is that it helps prepare children to meet the challenges of the digital society they live in. The most obvious way to reach children in the digital world is through their own digital devices, such as tablets and smartphones. Judith Polgar has achieved this already, having launched her own chess application called Chess Playground. Get out, everyone! We have arrived! Hello, guys! Judith is waiting for us! Hi, I'm Judith Polgar, the number one female chess player in the world. I'm a chess grandmaster and I will teach you how to play chess. Judith Polgar's skill building program for elementary schools is not about training the best chess players. The main focus is on improving children's academic skills and preparing them to become creative, innovative thinkers and successful human beings. So I hope I made you interested. This ancient yet very modern key can help your children get into the chess palace and gives them access to creative thinking.